Hey guys, it's me, Anna, and my trusty sidekick, Mookie. We both kind of had a helmet hair earlier, so we did the best we could to look presentable, but you know, we're in an indefinite lockdown here. You guys are really the only people that have seen me all week. Not gonna lie, mostly wearing leggings and sweatpants. I, I actually thought that maybe I deserved an Oscar for pretending like everything's okay, but I did shop the Lily Pulitzer after party sale and I thought you guys might be interested. So I'm just gonna show you what I got. I'm gonna start with this really pretty scarf. I think that everybody gets their first Lily item and it's kind of like the gateway clothing to opening you up to the world of Lily Pulitzer. Mine was a scarf and I bought another one because I feel like it's the perfect thing to get to inject any item of clothing or outfit that you already own with a little bit of cheerful happiness. I'll put the names of the prints on the screen because like I don't actually remember which ones I bought online. I thought this was really good because it has black and blue and pink and white so you really can wear it with anything. I've mostly been wearing it with my uh, sweatpants outfits but you could probably wear it to an office. The Lily Pulitzer item that makes it on the most Pinterest boards are definitely the dresses. I got this one. It's kind of crazy because it's bright neon pink with blue and yellow pineapples and like a rope detail around the neck. But I just thought this was really fun and it kind of reminds me of Hawaii. I really am going to enjoy wearing this probably with like a denim jacket and maybe some nice sandals or sneakers. I also got this dress with like a bit of a ruffly collar. It's got these cute little gold buttons and the pattern has seahorses and mermaids, which I just think is so cute. I think I'm gonna wear this actually with like a plain white cardigan or something that isn't like loud, but I feel like this is also something that you can kind of wear around the house because the jersey fabric is super comfortable and it's not going to wrinkle easily if you're like sitting down all day or just hanging out at home. And then we've got my final item. I love tennis skirts. I think they're really cute. They're kind of casual, but not like slobby. I think that's really the thing that in quarantine, you're like, how do I dress comfortably without looking like a total slob? Because it's nice to be comfortable, but to also feel like you've gotten ready for the day. And this has the elastic waistband, which we're all loving right now. It's got some built-in shorts, but it's gonna be a lot more comfortable than any of my other like more athletic tennis skirts because it's made out of like a Jersey cotton and it's a lot more breathable than the spandex like ones that I wear for actually playing tennis. And I just feel like this is going to be really comfortable on like any weekend or like having brunch and just wearing like a nice white t-shirt and some sneakers with it. I'm really looking forward to wearing this stuff because normally I'm not like so much of a Lily person. I feel like it's a lot and people don't really wear Lily Pulitzer that much where I live. But in these times, I have just been so drawn to it. There's something about this clothing that just makes you feel happier. Like all the bright, colorful patterns are bringing happiness into my life. And I think that I didn't need that so much because before there were like more things to do and I was in a better mood in general. But right now, I feel like anything that makes me feel a bit more cheerful, I'm like so drawn to. And this is definitely fitting the bill for me right now, but I'd love to know what you guys think. Are you Lily Pulitzer lovers? Do you have like a few things or did you know, not know like that much about this brand before the video? I'd love to know. Thanks for watching. Bye.